Hey everybody! We are making musical shaker bottles today. So we're going to go through and we're going to show you what materials we have to put our bottles together. The first thing you are going to need is a recycled water bottle. So we have our recycled water bottles right here. And I'm going to lift this up so that Isla can show you what we have in our tray. So Isla, what do we have in our tray? Beads. We have beads. Um, popcorn kernels. Popcorn kernels. Rice. Sequins, mini sequins. <laughs> Baked sequins. Pom poms. Good. So these are just the things that we chose to put in our shaker bottles. If you guys have different things around your house that you'd like to put in your shaker bottles, that's totally up to you. Um, and we also don't need to use all of these. These are just things that we gathered. And then we have one more thing that we're going to add on to our shaker bottle. Right, Isla? Right? We have Streamer. ribbon streamers that we're going to put around the edge just for a little bit of fun. Okay? So, Isla, I'll hold your bottle here for you. What are you going to put in your bottle first? She's going with the popcorn kernels. So you want something that's going to make a little bit of noise. So I'm gonna put some in too. So I'm putting some popcorn kernels in my bottle. She's also adding rice to hers. Yeah, so we're filling our bottles up with all sorts of goodies. I think I'm gonna do what Isla's doing too. I'm gonna to use a little bit of everything, just cause it's kind of fun. And the pom-poms are for some color inside. Yeah, the pom-poms are mostly just for color to make it a little bit more fun. They're not going to be very musical. <laughs> but all of the other things that we have in our tray would make it make different kinds of noise. So we are putting all sorts of goodies into our water bottles. Woo, there goes the rice. <laughs> I'm going to put some pom-poms in mine. Now, I was telling Isla before we started, we don't want to fill them up too much because then we're not going to have you know, room to shake it. So we're only putting some stuff inside. All right, I'm gonna put some sequins in mine. I've got big sequins and I've got little sequins. We're just having fun picking whatever we want. And like I said, if you don't have these materials at your house, that's okay. You can get different ones. You can use different ones. This rice is making a mess, it's going all over. All right, I think I think I need some popcorn kernels. I need more popcorn kernels in mine. Me too. <laughs> I think you might need a few more pom poms in yours, Isla. You think you need more pom poms? We're having fun filling them up. A little bit more. I think you could use some more some more goodies in there. All right, I have mine. Woo, see all my goodies inside of there? Got all sorts of things. You wanna put more in your Zyla? Yeah, I don't understand. Okay. All the pom-poms are used up. Yep, we used all the pom-poms up. <laughs> Do a few more popcorn kernels. Good. <laughs> Make sure to not spill the rice all over your house. <laughs> like us, oops. <laughs> okay, once you have your bottle filled up as much as you'd like, you're gonna take your lid and you're gonna screw it on nice and tight so that your insides don't fall out, right? Or you could super glue it. And you could glue it, but that has to be with the grown up, right? And give your bottle a shake. Yay! So see, make sure you like how it sounds. And then you can always decide if you want to add more things to it. Okay, so the last thing that we have to put on our shaker bottles, oh, hold on, <laughs> those are for me, are our ribbon streamers. Now hold on, Ayla, you're not waiting for directions. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I want to use all my ribbon streamers. Ayla, do you want to use all of your ribbon streamers? Uh -huh. We like lots of ribbons on ours. So you want to grab your ribbons. I already cut ours so that they're all the same length. And you want to hold them together. Right? 
So I'm putting all of my ribbons together so that the ends are matching. Make sure you don't drop them because they're super girly. <laughs> now you can use real ribbon. Um, this is ribbon that I had in my wrapping paper area. So this is curling ribbon, right, that you can use to wrap presents with. So we're getting all of ours lined up. Getting all yours lined up? Uh-huh. Good. All right, I've already got mine ready. So while she's finishing that, I have all my streamers together. I'm going to take them. I want to kind of fold them in half. If it's not perfect, that is okay because we can always trim them. So I folded them in half. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my water bottle. <laughs> there you go. And I'm going to wrap them around the neck of the water bottle. It's called neck. Yeah, sure. Right here. Okay. And then we're going to tie it in a knot so that it does not come undone. Right. So we're going to tie it in a knot. Oopsies, I missed one of my colors. I missed my pink. Okay. So there's my first part. And then I'm going to take it. I'm going to finish my knot off. Okay, you I might need a grown-up to help you with that part. So, I need help. You need help. I'll help you do it in just a second. So, I've got all my ribbon streamers on mine. Okay? Then, I like making curly Q ribbons. So, Isla, I know you gathered those up, and we will get those on your bottle. We're going to set those down right here. I would like you to hold on to my bottle for me so I don't pull it over. Okay, now this is also probably a grown-up job because I'm going to take my scissors, I'm going to hold on to my ribbon, and I'm going to give it a little pull. Sometimes you got to do it a couple times so that it's nice and curly. Okay, so I'm going to pull my next ribbon out. Hey, I did this before, I think. Yeah, have you done this? And I'm going to pull it, I'm going to zip it along my ribbon. So like I said... Really? Maybe a grown-up should do this part unless you're a little bit older or a big brother or a big sister, right? But make sure you have permission to use those scissors. We don't want to use scissors without our parents' permission. Hey, you're supposed to be holding my water bottle. No, we don't zip it over. She forgot what her job was. So I'm still zipping all my ribbons, making them nice and curly. Curly, curly, curly. Now, like I said, you don't have to have curly ribbons, but I like my ribbons curly, so that's what we're doing. Do you want your ribbons curly too, Isla? Yeah. Okay. We'll probably finish Isla's bottle after the video, because you don't need to see this part twice. So I'm zipping my ribbons. Let's see. Here's another one that needs to be curled. So I zip it. And then going on to this one. The ones that are wavy. Don't need very much curl. Oh yeah, because some of them curl better than others, don't they? Whoop! And sometimes I miss the ends. There's another one. And there's this one too. This one's straight, so you need to yep. this one. Thank you, Isla. She found another straight one for me. We almost got all of them. Whoop! Gotta get this one. And we're gonna zip it. And, oh, this one, then the end is not very good. I'm going to fix that end. And this green one needs a little bit more curl. I missed that end, too. There we go. All right. So we have all these curly ribbons on our shaker bottle. And we've got fun stuff inside so that when we dance around with it, it bounces and it shakes. And it's a lot of fun. All right. So I hope you guys. Have a good time making your shaker bottles just like Isla and I had fun making our shaker bottles. All right. Bye.